To err is human. To get some is divine. If God is real, he'd probably wield an MA-5B. This gas-operated, magazine-fed, 900 RPM slug thrower is the backbone of any fire team in the United Nations Space Command. Anyone dumb enough to be caught on the wrong end of this weapon is doomed to become more lead than man. Even shielded opponents can't endure the weapon's torrent of fire for very long. In close quarters, a 60-round sustained spray can be devastating. Go the distance, however, and operators should temper their trigger finger and their expectations. Designed for Earth's spacefaring navy, the MA-5B probably wasn't meant to see the outside of a cruiser. In a vacuum, the rifle's role as a corridor shooter is obvious, but these are desperate times. Stranded on Halo, an expansive alien ring world, the UNSC needs to adapt or die. So too does their humble rifle. Success in this new theater of war hinges on Marines' ability to adapt and overcome, to understand the limitations of their weapon system and engage on their own terms. At optimal range, victory is assured. It's getting there that's the problem. In-game, Halo's assault rifle is polarizing. It's certainly intended to follow its namesake, but couldn't stick the landing. The pistol does more damage, has tremendous range, and ammo for both is equally plentiful. If you can aim, the AR might already be on the road to irrelevance. Just to twist the knife, the player gets the pistol first. But what we lack in quality, we make up in quantity. The assault rifle is Halo's dustpan, batting cleanup on any foes you get intimate with. A shower of 762 can tear grunts, jackals, and even elites to shreds. Shields be damned. At range, things get tricky. Your firing cone is huge, and most shots will go wayward, out of the crosshair even. But if you hit, bam, dead alien. Aim to turn that if into a when. Best practices, get close enough to brush his teeth, then open up. If things get sticky, break out the mop instead. Where the pistol seeks tact and a steady hand, the assault rifle demands heaps of grit and a bucket of guts.